Begin by getting comfortable, closing your eyes, covering them, wearing a headset, blocking out the outside distractions. Take a breath in with a nice strong exhale to release and relax even deeper. Settle in, becoming more comfortable, letting go of more of the distractions, relaxing, softening more of the body with every breath, every exhale. We're about to go on a guided healing journey meditation. Combined with turtle energy. You feel caught up in a chaotic and hectic lifestyle and you want to change it to a slower pace, but you're not sure how to do so. You're feeling weighted down and overwhelmed by all your responsibilities even though you've created them by taking on too much. You feel like giving up, but something inside you knows that you need to keep moving on. You've tried to accomplish a particular task, but keep getting thrown off by various demands and distractions, such that you feel off-center. You've been feeling scattered and spacey and need to get yourself grounded by spending more time in nature. Breathe and exhale, letting it go, letting go what you can. As we enter into nature, in our vision, in your imagination, your mind's eye, we can begin anywhere in nature that you feel drawn, wherever you feel most resonated most comfortable, most at peace, most relaxed. Anywhere in nature, far away from all other distractions and people that will distract you, distort your frequency or your thinking. And again, with every breath and every exhale, you relax even deeper. You're moving around in nature, observing, admiring all the elements, all the sounds, all the textures, all the colors. Just soaking it in. As we move through this wilderness, this nature scene, you begin to sense and feel other like-minded family, friends, soul connections, off in the far distance, far enough you don't see them, but close enough you can feel they're over there, in every direction around you. They're there. Just notice them, feel them, the excitement getting to share the same expressions, the same perspectives, the same feelings on things. No judgments, just a strong, unequivocal connection to your soul. And notice now there are angels, high frequency, benevolent beings, presenting throughout your wilderness, throughout your nature scape. A variety of them scattered all about and start taking note too of the love and the light and the support that they continually provide even when we don't know what we don't know begin to feel how you're no longer alone begin to feel the oneness the unity the connection Another breath to clear out distractive, distorted thoughts, negative programming. Just letting it go, setting it aside. Relax. 
relaxing even more into the body, softening, loosening. And the closer they become to support, to nourish, nurture, guide, protect you, sense, feel, know this. There's a calming, comforting feeling, identifying them in such a way that says you're not alone. You don't need names or labels of any kind. Just feel them, sense them, know that they're there. And they start to reach out to embrace your hand, take you on a journey. We're going to travel through this beautiful nature scape, that beautiful light portal. As we step through, as we approach it, you can feel the excitement, the amazement of how it just seemed to appear out of nowhere. But you can feel the high frequency. You can acknowledge it, see it, sense it, know it on some level. That although this is different, that although this is unusual, it is real. This light portal will take us over to the beach, out to the ocean. We'll first stop at the beach. So we walk through hand in hand with each other and our angels, your guides or guardians, whoever you wish to walk through this with. Oh, one more breath and exhale and take your step through. Notice how your feelings in the body, zinging, tingling, buzzing, lightheaded, spacey, dizziness, any of these things are normal for this. Just notice it, acknowledge it. It will shift here again momentarily and it's okay if you're not feeling or sensing these things. Everybody interprets the energy shifts differently. Some yawn a lot, some cough a lot, some burp, some twitch. Everyone's different. As we step through without any indication in time or space, we suddenly pop out onto this serene and beautiful beach where life has been able to regenerate and multiply as it's meant to be. Seashells, coral pieces, just life, things being the way they are. Little critters in and out of the sand. Just notice everything around you, the fresh air off the ocean, cooling, splashing against the sand and the beach. The birds in the air, you can hear it, you can feel the wind on your face, on your body. And as we walk together to this area of the beach, this is where the turtles have nested their eggs. And you're just about to witness their birth. As they crack their shells, peek through and pull through completely out of the shell, leaving what was once their home that nourished them, that protected them, that kept them safe, is no longer serving them. They bust through the shell, some more gentle than others, each to their own. And as they escape from that encasing, that home, that protection, they face a bright new world. Their excitement as they know the oceans straight ahead of them. Feel this for yourself. Acknowledge this within yourself. Your old home, your old environments, your old protections. Perhaps they were never there. Perhaps they were, but they're not working anymore. 
Acknowledge that this is now time, time to let that go and embrace the new home, the new earth, the new energy, the new life, high frequency, benevolent, loving, compassion, joy, happiness, humor. Yes, yes, yes. Allowing yourself to imagine or visualize that you yourself is coming out of one of those eggshells. Watch yourself as you stand on the sand, admiring all the turtles coming out. And yet there's also a part of you that's breaking out of the shell as well. Notice how this part is so excited, so fresh, full of possibilities, full of hope, full of love, self-love, self-healing. The parts of you that you've been seeking and longing for that you haven't perhaps found in others, other people or other experiences, because they don't have it. You have it. You've always had it. And it's time to let that birth through and embrace that part of yourself. Here goes your egg. It's cracking. Here's your egg. It's cracking. Notice it. So exciting. So exciting to see this new version of you. This true version of you, this authentic version of you coming online, breaking through the density and the low vibrations to help you raise yours. There they go, there's the head, there's the head. Very cool. It may start out looking just like a baby turtle, or maybe it starts out looking like a baby version of you in the egg. Doesn't matter. It's you. It'll transform to be exactly as it needs to be for you in this moment. All the turtles are cracking through the shells. They're all running down the beach. Side to side wobble as they make it through the sand and the barnacles and the shells and the rocks and the debris on the sand. Running, running, running. Oh, they're so excited to get to that water. Just, just feel that excitement. Just so exciting. Hey, cheer it on. Go, go, you got it. Keep going. And they splash into the water. They head out deeper and deeper. They float on the top. They go underwater. They're exploring the floor, ground of the ocean. They're all doing whatever it is they want to do. They're all doing what makes them feel happy. They're all exploring and learning about themselves and how they fit into the environment and the circumstances. They trust their instincts when they need to go deeper, when they can come closer to shore, when they can go to the surface of the water, when they can go deeper into the depths of the ocean further out. They trust their instincts. These beautiful qualities. Patience. Determination. Achieving what they're after. Taking time. Slowing down. Enjoying the scenery. They don't take on too many problems and troubles of others. They don't do it at all. They pay particular attention to the shifting sensations in their body and in the water. The water is part of their body. Your body is part of the water. Water is part of your body. They feel the subtle resonating energies that vibrate from the earth. They carry messages. Notice this within yourself as well. Pay particular attention to the things that you feed your body, the nourishment, the nutrition. There's no judgment. It's not really right or wrong or good or bad. It just is. Notice what you feed yourself and notice how it really affects you, slows you down, drags you down. Perhaps those are things that uh, are not healthy or not nurturing for your body. Have what you want in moderation. 
moving through the water slowly, attentively. You can discover the great deal of wisdom emerging from unexpected sources that you would have otherwise missed from being in a hurry. Another breath, another exhale, relaxing, deepening into this vision. As we get further out into the ocean, noticing you're still not alone. There's still your soul friends and soul family out here with you, and dozens upon dozens and dozens of turtles. Your angels, your guides, your guardians, all everyone is here. If you connect to the animals of the ocean, they're here. They're supporting you. As we get further and further out into the ocean, we're traveling come upon a current, a current under the water. This is your opportunity. This is your chance to continue taking all of that which is overwhelming, exhausting, draining, burdening, the weight of the world, the elephant that sits on your chest and makes it hard to breathe. All that you have taken on of others, other people's problems, other people's fears, other people's troubles. Just notice how much baggage, how much you're carrying, how much weight is really not yours. We're about to go into this current. With the turtles, they will guide us. Know you are safe. You are safe. You feel the rhythm of how fast the current is going as you hover by, as you hover nearby. And just as you get into the rhythm, you start feeling the synchronicity of that flow. You begin to notice your opportunity to enter it. It's not going to be shocking. It's going to be smooth. It's going to be easy going because you're matching to the rhythm, to the flow. And you go right in. And we're swimming downstream, moving with the stream. Letting the current take us where we need to go. Some of us are jarring and jiggling and moving and bouncing gently, but enough. This is your opportunity. Let that old, heavy, negative stuff just rattle right out of you. Let the currents jiggle it. Just bump it. Drop it. Let it go. Pop it out there like a slingshot. Throw it like a rock. Drop it like a bag. Any number of ways. Just let it go. Use your breath and on the exhale, it's out there. <sighs> Releasing and letting go. However many number of times you need to till you feel you get everything. Everything that you can possibly be aware of in this moment. And then some more for the ones that you may not necessarily be conscious of at this moment. Picture it welling up into a big ball as you inhale, collect, collect, collect it all. And as you exhale, release the ball, release it into the current. The ocean, the water elements, the water spirits, they will take care of it. They will transmute it. You are safe. Different images, different feelings, different sensations as you release. The current is shifting and moving. It can feel like you're a little bit on a roller coaster. Up, down, up and down. Swish to the right, to the left. Swish back and forth again, up or down. Not quite enough to make you dizzy or nauseous, but enough for you to release. Jiggle it, jiggle it loose. The vibration of the motion in the water. Bumping up against you like bubbles in a hot tub. Just let it take it away, all of it, as it runs along your skin, along your body, along your face, along your hair. Let it take it from your hands. Let it release it from your shoulders. Let it pull it from the bottom of your feet. Oh, so many ways. Just letting it go, letting it go. Things that are really holding on, anything you have that's super tight, you got a tight grip, 
not moving, not getting released. Just acknowledge it. Don't judge it. Relax, relax. Our opportunity to exit the current is coming up. Continuing to release and let go of any more that you have at this time that you wish to let go of. Breathing in and out. And our exit is on one, two, three. And you're now out of the current. Collecting everybody as they come out so we're all still together. Those who wanted to come out are out. The turtles that want to keep going can keep going. As we swim here in this mild, calm area of water, floating, regenerating, letting the water spirits, the water elements hold us and carry us gently, supporting us, healing us. And now a new portal a new light portal has opened. This portal will take us back to our, our nature scene, your nature scape, your favorite place in nature, wherever that is. Even if it doesn't even exist anymore, it's still accessible. Just imagine it. As you're holding hands with your angels, your guides, guardians, or any other number of beings that support you. Again, everybody's lining up. And as you're ready, swim right into the light portal. And as we go in, there you go, one after the other, you find yourself coming out on the other side, right in that area of nature that we began with. Take another breath, reacclimate to the space, Breathing that fresh, clean, crisp air. Hearing the birds, perhaps, animals. Or you hear the wind through the trees. You hear the leaves falling. You hear the soft whispers of all the nature beings talking to you. Notice how much more connected you are. How much more easier it is to hear and receive Feeling the joy, feeling the excitement, feeling happiness and hope and healing within yourself because you are willing to move on, because you are willing to accept what is yours, because you're willing to let go of what is not yours. Notice how light you're feeling, how freer you feel. Your responsibilities are yours. The other person's responsibility is theirs, not yours. Take on only that which is yours. Keep moving on in a good way. Keep moving forward with love for yourself, with expansion and knowing that you're not alone, that you're always protected and guided. And notice how you feel clearer. You're going to see things differently in life. You're going to acknowledge them with more truth and authenticity. More neutrality. To not judge yourself or others. It just is and everyone is trying to find their way through it. Another breath with a nice strong exhale as we finish up. Allowing yourself to feel more present in your body, wiggling your hands, ankles, feet, toes, fingers, stretching, yawning. Open your eyes when you're ready. Let them adjust to the light in the room. 
Notice the colors, the textures, feeling, touching, seeing all that's around you to bring your awareness back into your body. Don't stand up if you're feeling lightheaded, dizzy, or spacey. Just wait a moment. It'll continue to shift. You are integrating. You are becoming your true authentic self. As you feel that you're ready to stand, you may do so, but be careful. Let yourself play and revel in the goodness of how this feels right now for as long as you can. Continue feeling how great this feels. Embrace the new you, the more empowered you. Continue loving yourself more every day. And even just the one, the one person can make such significant changes in our existence. You are that one for all that you do for yourself, for your own healing, heals your lineage, heals your family, heals your ancestors and all the DNA that you and your bloodline carry. You are healing far more than just yourself. This is a time of importance that even if it seems small, it really, really is big. Pat yourself on the back Treat yourself to something special. Anything that's making you feel good within reason, within moderation. Spread the joy, spread the love. Smiling is contagious, as is laughter. Enjoy your experiences, learn from them and grow. You are loved. You are greatly loved. We often ask for things in prayer, and you do receive the answers and guidance through meditation. Make time for yourself to quiet the mind through journey work, meditation work, or other guided resources. When you begin to quiet the mind, you're technically quieting the left side, the left brain. And as it synchronizes with the right half, or the right side, and the right brain, they come harmonic. This is where you hear your messages. This is where you hear them more clearly, feel them, sense them, know them, intuitively. Connect every day. Start your day with this tone of positivity, nurturance, happiness, joy, and perhaps even ending your evening with the same, meditating, journeying, or whatever method brings peace and quiet to your mind and the chatter, allowing for your brain to have time to synchronize both hemispheres. Give yourself a great big hug, literally or figuratively, love, love, love yourself. Creator loves you, Spirit loves you, God loves you. You are loved more than you know. You are precious. Feel this truth, receive this truth, and continue spreading it as much and often as you can. Blessings.